In this episode of Trimer and Triumph, we install our new BNG chart plotter and complete our annual spring commissioning in preparation for the cruising season. project for the weekend is to install our new chart plotter. After years of service, our old chart plotter has finally kicked the bucket. Replacing it includes replacing the old instrument in the cockpit, running the new wiring, and replacing the transducer. A transducer is an important electrical sensor device that provides water depth under the boat, and removing it is no easy task. Hey Francois, what are you doing? Yeah, so this is the least fun part of the install is uh, removing the old transducer and putting a new one. So of course uh, it's been there for 25 years and uh, yeah, it's pretty well installed. And yeah, just there's these little tabs here you have to undo and uh, they're, yeah, they're just hard to reach and there's not much space to work in there. So I'm gonna have to remove here the little plate so I can reach underneath and maybe just hit it a little bit with a tool. I got this big plier, but it's just hard to kind of get it around and actually there's not much space to turn it. So yeah, there you go. That's the fun of working on boats. Always have some stuff uh, that's a little bit more challenging than you would think initially. Okay, while Francois works in the bow on the transducer, I am going to um, work on pulling, starting to pull all the panels off. So this is the back of the instrument. I'm gonna take this panel off and uh, the instrument uh, off. Okay, so I've got the panel off here. I've got the instrument out. Um, while the panel's off, I'm gonna take a couple of minutes and just clean back here. We don't have that panel off very often. So uh, that's my next task. Um, Francois is still in the bow, um, working on getting that transducer out. We knew that was gonna be one of the hardest parts of this project. So still uh, working away on that. Um, and, uh, but progress is, uh, is coming along. We have progress. There is a little hole and uh, I can see him through the little hole. So we are making progress, which is great. Okay, so I have uh, started going through the wiring and my next task is to um, take off the GPS and try and pull the wiring out uh, through the boat. So the GPS wire comes through here, through the aft cabin. Um, this uh, normally covers it, so it's nice and pretty, but I've pulled it open and I'm just following the wire uh, right through uh, out where it leads there to the GPS. Well, hi there. <laughs> so two and a half hours later, now we got a big hole in the boat. We succeeded. <laughs> that was the goal, but uh, it was pretty hard. I don't think it would have come off uh, anytime soon, but uh, yeah, finally got it off. We only used a drill, a Dremel, a couple sets of pliers, hammer, screwdriver, and uh, a bit of swearing. 
and I got some plastic bits in my eyes from underneath, I'm just grinding it. But hey, we got it off now. <laughs> so a little bit of swearing as well. But yeah, there it is. We are ready to uh, clean it up now. Now I gotta clean it up a bit, file the edges. And uh, there's a small section where I can see, um, and I don't think it was, I think it must have been like that before, but there's a small spot where you can see the core in there a little bit, like there's a bit of foam there. So I'm gonna have to uh, make sure I seal that a bit before with some uh, polyester resin or, or, uh, or epoxy. Just a little bit of, I think putty will do the trick here. Uh, I've got this pretty good kind of polyester stuff and then we can um, put some, the new transducer in there. So hopefully, um, hopefully it fits in the same hole. I think it will. I think it's the same size, so it should go pretty well. So there we go. Moving forward. All right, uh, we got the uh, transducer in uh, the front there, but then uh, after that comes the fun of the wiring. So we used the old wire that was there to pull the new one through. Um, and the plug just fits into the this little hole here. So we had to go through there under here. And then there's a, uh, under the, the settee here, under the bench, there's a, there's a tube that goes there. So we gotta pull it through there and then out through here through this one here. I had to get a little creative here because the plug just fits into this hole. So we use our Dremel to make a little um, slit here for the other wire. So we can just push it over and then make a little cut in this little protector here. Uh, and then it still fits even though it's got a little tiny cut with the knife. So then it still protects our wire. And then, um, yeah, now we got our transducer plug that'll go to our instrument up here. Big hole there. And uh, from there, uh, now the next step is to plug the power wire. So we, luckily we got some, some power right here. So I do a little bit more wiring and uh, good progress. With the new chart plotter installed and ready to go, we used all of our remaining time to knock off a couple other projects and requirements to ensure we are ready for the cruising season, which we kick off with our Desolation Sound cruise in early April.
time as we set sail for an early season Desolation Sound cruise and our first of the 2024 season. <laughs> 